Here we go again. Another week of finding out results from my experiments and fingers crossed they have worked this time because it's getting a bit too much. <laughs> Constantly failed with experiments over and over again. So pray for me. Pray! Hello, good morning. Actually, I'm going to put this off because that is very loud. How the heck? Oh, I don't want to ruin anyone's sample. Ah. Okay, I don't know. I came in early before uh, lab demonstrating because I thought I had to sterilize some stuff that I needed for my experiment this afternoon. But past Jessica has already done it and my memory has failed me and I forgot that I already done it. So well done past Jessica for actually sterilizing the correct number of pipette tips that I need for this afternoon. Honestly, my memory is so terrible. I think because I have so many things to think about on a daily basis with all of my work and stuff that I just forget minor details like is all my equipment prepared but I'm so organized most of the time that I prepare quite a few days in advance so I should just trust that past Jessica has everything under control. So here I am, it's four o'clock and I'm heading back to the building. I've just been at home for a few hours. I have an experiment to start at about 6.30. So I'm gonna be here now from four o'clock until eight o'clock. So I thought I would go home and have lunch and then come back so I'm not sitting around at uni all day in my face mask. So here we go. I couldn't quite remember if I mentioned earlier about why I am got this weird day today where I kind of went home and I've come back to uni again but I've basically been trying this experiment for quite a while now maybe the last couple of months growing bacteria to try and make them form biofilms so basically like a slimy film like ones that you'd maybe get in your bathroom like on your on your bath or forming around your shower head that kind of green slime I'm trying to make my bacterial strains that I'm working with grow biofilms so I can test my compounds to see if it stops them from growing those biofilms but for some reason they do not want to form these biofilms they just they grow nicely but they're not they're not growing the films so yeah today's been a weird one because I was transferring my bacteria on Wednesday to my plate but I was doing it at time intervals and I did it um, from one hour to eight hours so that meant I finished at half past six on Wednesday and then according to my protocol, I have to leave my, uh, my bacteria growing at 28 degrees for 48 hours, which means that I can't work with them until half past six today, which happens to be Friday. <laughs> yeah, so hopefully once uh, it, half past six comes, it doesn't take too long for me to do the rest of the test and fingers crossed it's worked out this time. Because if it hasn't worked out this time, I think I might need to put this part of my project to the side for a while and focus on other things because it's taking up far too much of my time, so wish me luck!
six and I'm just sitting and waiting now for my plates to dry but I think I've done something wrong because they do not look how I hoped they would look. This is just really difficult because I'm basically setting up something new that no one in my lab has done before and I don't have anyone to show me how to do it. So I'm just kind of trying to do it completely blind on my own. I haven't watched anyone else do it so I don't know if at each stage my plates look like how they're supposed to. So I'm not feeling too optimistic at this point unfortunately um, but I'll just wait and see when they're ready, when they're dry and we'll see how they've turned out. So I'm sitting in the car now, it is 7.55 and I just left and I did not get my results. <laughs> I waited all this time for my plates to dry in order to get some results on them and they didn't even dry on time. Happy Friday. <laughs> ah, some of them look okay. I, I, the thing with this study is that you have to add a dye to the wells in order to see if it's worked or not. It's this bright purple dye and I can't do that until they're dry. So hopefully leaving them over the weekend isn't going to affect them too much. But we will see. So now I will not have results until Monday. So I guess we just live, leave this on a cliffhanger. Tune in next time in order to find out whether my experiment was a success or a fail. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Bye. Thank you.